round and 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 round Is this is the milk contraption? Finally, you finished this... the milk contraption. It does. Does it work? <laughs> oh, the milk! Yeah. It's beautiful. <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> I love the milk. Hey, all guys. I'm Sarah from 190, and I am on an awesome build, an awesome Titanic, and it is much better than my Titanic. I shit you not. I shit you. Not. I'm not shitting right now, guys. I am here with my friend. The scout's not. And yeah, he built this. Guys, in four months. And this is a captain. And uh, he's gonna show me around. And he knows a lot about this place. He's, he knows. He built it, guys. He knows. So, uh. Okay. Let's do it, guys. So, yep. so right here was the forward aft. Due to microphone issues, I decided to cut his voice out completely. I'm so sorry, buddy. Maybe next time we'll get the audio corrected. And unfortunately, guys, the microphone wasn't working. I changed it to party play or gameplay or something like that. Completely muting uh, my friend's voice. So sorry about that, Scout. Um, look, man, I'm just gonna have to play your part too. Uh, anyway, so this is the switch when the bar goes. Okay, no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do that. So, guys, I'm gonna have to just talk over as a com commentary instead of live play, guys. So I apologize for that. I'll get it right one day. So here we are in uh, the dancing area in which uh, you will see um, Rose and Jack dancing in the bottom class. And I'm also here, I'm, this is hard to do. I'm in the ship in the front yeah. of the boat, boat and yeah. there's a little wheel in which makes this boat drive around. Whew. All right, so now uh, he's just showing me around. He was telling me all about it. Uh, he was telling me when it was made, who it was designed by, and uh, all those crazy facts that you get in a history book. He was full of awesome information. He knew this place like the back of his hand. He created this entire Titanic in four months, guys. And here he was showing me about the drain on the top there, I like that. And this is the main quarters where the stairs, you know, those famous stairs, you know, in the movie with the dome above the head there, you can see when I look up. And that is pretty cool. As you guys know, I have a Titanic as well. And yes, I want to compare Titanics because we should compare! Mine's smaller than this Titanic. This, tita this Titanic's more accurate as well. And it has all the rooms in which mine... Uh, there's a lot of guesswork in mine. He said that he did this by guesswork, but it's very accurate. I don't know. I don't know. I think he's pulling my leg there. I think he's looked at the blueprints or something because it looks pretty damn accurate Ac accurate you know some pictures or something wow look at that guys nice work though my titanic's not as accurate i don't know it's a little bit more uh, it's a little smaller too and uh i'll show you guys would you like to see my titanic right after this titanic so this is his titanic and it's very nice, very, long. very long, and it has a lot of detail and a lot of rooms inside. And I'm gonna jump off the ship to do that scene where I fall into the cold. I'm gonna commit suicide. No! It is cold, you were right! It is like a thousand knives stabbing me all over my body. Okay, now that I've got that out of my system, we're back in my world. And we're going to have a look through at my Titanic to see the differences and to see what artistic paths we chose. Get get off me, bro. What are you doing? Step back. Follow me, man. We're going to go straight to the Titanic. But first, we have to go to the roller coaster. So follow me real quick. This is in my world, Shambhala. So this is where I can show you guys my design I got from a Lego set and recreated it on Minecraft so this is how I got my design and there you can see it down below but we have to go a lot quick a lot closer so let's go there now guys all right so we're in the inn and now we have to go back on the roller coaster to get to the Titanic so I'm just waiting for my buddy there he is there he is he made it you made it buddy all right now we have to go back in to get to the Titanic, so 
Follow me. Won't you? Alright. After a while of consideration, we decided to go to the Titanic. So, let's go. If you want to take a world tour, you can. You just go in here and you go... Here we are guys, we finally made it to my Titanic. Now this is my version of the Titanic. As you can see, it is probably half the size. It is actually somewhat smaller. And um, as far as accuracy goes, well this is based on the Lego build, the model, so I don't know. I really don't know what's going on with accuracy between the ships. They look very similar, but yet a very different artistic style has gone in. Uh, mine feels a little different because it's in the city texture pack, which I feel gives it a little bit more of a modern, a little bit more of a modern feel to it, which I think I prefer. Though it probably isn't as accurate as the last one, um, and also there's a lot of rooms yet that have to be filled in, and that's the same for both Titanics apparently, where they're both kind of empty at the moment. But he has a lot of uh, detail in it, just like I have here as well. So this is my version of the Titanic. And it is, uh, I think they're both magnificent. Uh, this took me uh, nine hours to build um, the structure of the Titanic and about three or four months to fill it in. Okay, so that's like, you know, putting the water in, putting the roller coaster in, putting the, you know, the plants and, you know, sprucing it up a little bit, um, making it look good took a long time as well. And yeah guys, so if you enjoyed this video in comparisons of two different types of Titanics and you want to build a Titanic, I suggest you build one in between if that's possible. Thank you. Please like and subscribe to my video and uh, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out. Oh, you're still here, I see. I guess you want to see more. Alright, well stick around, guys, because I'm about to go to my friend Bagel's world, and I'll show you a couple of funny contraptions he's come up with. So come and join me, guys. Let's go. Did you guys know that you can walk through... You can, you can walk through these things? Huh? Yes. Huh? Very nice. Very, very toasty. Did you know that, guys? You can walk through pistons? If you're real, real careful. Did you know that, guys? Did you know? Uh oh. <laughs> it's definitely too warm in here. Who's this ninja? Hello. Come to the, come to the front. <laughs> Is this his, the milk contraption? Finally, you finished this... the milk contraption. It does. Does it work? <laughs> Oh, the milk! Yeah! It's beautiful! <laughs> it's beautiful! <laughs> I love the milk! Uh, it's all over me! I can swim in milk, finally! My dream. Okay, now, it's now I want chocolate it's milk. Like five, million year oh. five million years to create. Million. Oh That's yeah, it's a lot of milk. That's all I can have. That's all I can drink right now. Too much but, milk. Yeah, it's my wow, that must be so, that must be a stored up. <laughs> that must be. <laughs> yes. There we go. Uh, this is like glitching out, dude. Look at this. No, it's going in. It's going uh, in the dispensers and stuff. I get it. I get it. Yeah. Well, that's pretty cool. I like it. What do you call this? Your mum.